Good evening, friendos. It's time for Quest for Semi Glory. We're back to Untitled Goose Game tonight. Uh, last time, <laughs> we hassled a gardener, uh, bullied a nerd and a shopkeeper, and made two neighbors probably hate each other. Um, so, you know, just all in a day's work for, for a horrible goose. Um, so let's continue being that horrible goose, right? Because it's fun. It's actually really fun being this goose. <laughs> ah, I love it. Ah, I love it so much. All right, let's let's see what we got. What do we got to do? All right, so we're gonna we're gonna go visit the pub. We're gonna have a pint. <clears throat> get into the pub. Break the dartboard. Get the toy boat. Make the old man fall on his bum. Be awarded a flower. Steal a pint glass and drop it in the canal and set the table. Okay. See, I I, I like this kind of combo of tasks that we got to do. Most of it's rather destructive, but then usually there's a very helpful task at the end. Because last time we had a picnic, and um, we did some shopping, and then we did some laundry as well. So we're, we're a destructive goose, but we're also a very helpful goose. So let's, let's see what we can do here. Don't mind me. Just, just a goose, uh, goose on the town here. Ah, I see. So we're gonna get into the, get into the pub by, uh, by, uh, <laughs> getting in the box. Okay. Um, excuse me, sir. <laughs> that was fun. <laughs> eh, hey, hey, hey! Let her, let her, let her carry the box. Hey, what are you doing? <laughs> that was fun. Alright, yep, don't mind me. <laughs> Man, none of these people are uh, very good at the object permanence, are they? <laughs> Alright. Alright. Riding in a box. Ah, I see. So we we snuck past the bouncer by uh, by getting in this box. So let's see what what's this uh, what's this gonna do for us here? All right, so she's gonna open the back door for us. Yeah. Okay. Okay. There's the dartboard. <laughs> What's the matter? Have, never heard a box honk before? <laughs> Alright, we're in. We're in. Let's see. Let's see what we got here. Got some boxes. Oh, can we open this door? Oh, not from this side. Okay. What do we gotta do? Alright, so we're into the pub, right? We know where the dartboard is. We saw that on our way back. Or on our way to the back here. Get the toy boat, make the old man fall on his bumpy award of flower. Okay. Okay. Hmm. Okay, there must be a reason why we can grab that, huh? Ah, I see. <clears throat> so here's the plate we can use for setting the table. <laughs> hey, Omega Weapon, how you doing? to see it. We've already annoyed a couple people, like a couple minutes in, and we've already annoyed people. It's awesome. Like, being a goose is the best. Alright, so... What are we supposed to do now? We, we may have, uh, gone a bit too far in letting her carry the box back here, and then, uh, 
and having her close the door, so we might have to do something about this. Oh, wait. No, no, no. Here. We can get in. Oh, we can get in underneath. All right. All right. All right. All right. So we're going we're gonna to set the table somewhere, right? Oh, there's already a plate over here. Okay. Oh no, they're gonna kick me out. They're gonna try to kick me out. Oh no, he's kicking me out of the pub! Hey! Hey! I want you to serve geese? I could be a paying customer, you fuck! Oh, oh, I can, I can untie his shoes. I think. I think I was targeting his shoelace. up. Grab a shoelace. There we go. Yeah. What are you gonna do, huh? Shoes are untied, idiot. Yeah, that's right. <laughs> oh, awesome. <laughs> Dipshits. <laughs> Tripped over his own damn shoelaces. I love it. Oh, man. Okay, let's see. Okay, he's gonna play some darts, huh? Alright. <laughs> Idiot. Oh, can I grab the harmonica? <laughs> I love it. Can I untie your shoes? Oh no, he's wearing loafers. Okay, I can't untie his shoes. <laughs> hey, we got a flower. <laughs> Thank you, honk honk. <laughs> That's funny. Okay. Let's see. So we gotta we gotta set the table, right? So for a knife, fork, plate, pepper, and a candle. Steel pint glass. Make the old man fall on his bum. Like the old man who was playing darts there? Might be the same old man. Alright, let's see. So I need a oh no, no 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 no. You didn't see nothing. You didn't see nothing. Just a normal goose. Having a having a goose day here. Grab that pine glass <laughs> and go drop it in the canal. <laughs> hey, buddy. Hey. No, 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 no. I want that yet. I need that. Hey. All right. Fine. There. Yoink. <laughs> ah, no. Ah, you broke it before I could get it in the canal. You piece of shit. Jerk. Needed that. There. Tie your shoes, idiot. He better be tripping. He's gonna trip. Trip. <laughs> Idiots. Alright, we need another pint glass, and we need to be able to sneak it out past him. Alright, there's one. Bonk. Alright. Uh. Oh. I'm gonna be able to get out of here. Oh, no! Okay, there's another one. Eh. Oh. All right, fine. Jeez, I'll leave the open air patio. Fuck you. Oh, now he's after me now too. Excuse me. <laughs> Run defense for me, old man. There we go. All right, you didn't see nothing. The goose is gone. <laughs> All right, so we've successfully broken. 
two pint glasses. <clears throat> oh, and there's a there's a plate already over here, huh? is incredible. I've got a slight mobility advantage. <laughs> Very slight though, because it needs to be like it needs to be corners. I need to gain distance on the corners like Pac-Man. Ah oh no! Ah they broke my last bike glass. Bastards. Alright, fine, fine. Not wanted. Not wanted in the pub. Tactical espionage action goose here. There. Idiots. <laughs> Well, there's got to be another pint glass somewhere, right? I'm just gonna hide. I'm just gonna hide. Wait for him to find a pint glass for me. <laughs> I love that I'm slightly muffled because I've got a cork. <laughs> oh no! How did you see me? I was so well hidden. All right, I'll take the pepper as I go. Oh no! Okay. I go, oh, I can I can go under the table. Uh huh. Yeah. Object permanence, idiot. <laughs> okay, got a fork. Oh. Okay. Oh, excuse me. Sorry. I mean to interrupt your conversation there, honeys. wise to me if I keep doing this. Alright, I'll take my fork and go then. Oh, no, you want the fork. Alright, here, take the fork then. <clears throat> we have to figure out where they want us to set the table anyways. sneak under the table. All right. So which table do they want me to set? Does it matter? So I think we know where everything is. Like, there's the knife and the fork, there's the plate, the pepper's over there, and I think there was a candle on the right. Nope, oh, can't see me, I don't exist. <laughs> I'll take the napkin, though. <laughs> Just... 
Oh, I I think I know how to how to. <laughs> I think I know how to get him on his uh on his bum there. I need to I need to pull the chair out from under him as he's sitting down. There you go. No, oh, ha have a seat. Have a seat. I promise the chair's not going anywhere. I promise. All right. <laughs> I was about to say, come on, that doesn't count. <laughs> Steal your harmonica, because it's fun. <laughs> there, I'll even clean it out when I'm done with it. See, that's how, that's how health conscious the goose is. Even clean it out when he's done playing the harmonica. <clears throat> All right, so what table do they want me to set? There's like there's already a plate over here, right? Which is good. But like there has to be a table that I can access, right? I can like get up on a chair or a bench or something. Oh, that guy's back on the lookout. Oh, or maybe they are they talking about this table like uh, like a lady in the tramp style? You think that might make a lot of sense? Actually, let's see if that counts. Yep. Okay, that's where that's where they want me to set up shop. Um, I guess I will. Okay, here's what we're gonna do then, because I don't want them deconstructing my nice place setting here. So I'm going to block this door off. And hope that uh, they then cannot get in. Oop. Okay, so hopefully that'll stop them from bringing boxes back or something. So now I just need to procure some silverware, the pepper grinder, and a candle. Get some nice ambiance going. We'll bring this mop just in case we make a mess. That should probably be enough to block the door, huh? Okay. Just need the, the pepper grinder. It'll be an easy grab. Be like, whoop. I'm just gonna sneak on through here. And then bonk. No, yeah, no, no, you didn't see nothing. Oh, don't worry about this, Goose. Yeah, see, look at that. We were, we were thinking. Oh, no! Oh, no. <clears throat> Made it in the door anyways, huh? Okay. Well, let's just take a look at what they're doing. Knife and a fork and a candle. I think the candle is the probably the furthest one away, huh? Alright. No, no, no. Oh, no, get under the table. There we go. Yeah, there it is. It's over there. Grab the candle. <laughs> Can I get under the table with it? Yeah, I can. Oh, I can't. Okay, it's too big. That's right. It's very, very calmly sneak through. Oh, we can't go. Oh no, we can't. We just have to, to crouch down. All right. Candle. That counts, right? Does that count? That counts. All right. Knife and a fork then. Oh no, hey! Need that. Need that fork. Now it's all dirty and shit. Expect me to eat with it? Alright, whatever. That count? 
That counts. All right, there's the knife. Then we gotta find a boat, toy boat, and find a pint glass somewhere since we broke three of them. Good place setting. Perfect goose styled place setting. <laughs> okay, we gotta find a toy boat. Somewhere. If I were a toy boat, where would I be? Object permanence of a two-year-old. Oh, hey, they put a, a pint glass back there. Good. Oh, hey, oh, what do you think? <laughs> what do you think you're doing? Think you're gonna try to box me out for getting that <clears throat> that pint glass? Got another thing coming. chase here so I can get this out to the canal. Oh, you bastard. I was almost there, too. <laughs> Alright, well, if I can't put the, the pint glass in the canal, I'm gonna put this in the canal instead. <laughs> Ah, oh, shit, how do I get back up there? Alright, here we go. Knew I opened this door last time for a reason. I don't know if you can swim with the pint glass. All, all it tells me is that I gotta drop it in the canal. Without breaking it on the way there. Oh, and that dude kind of fucked off. All right, he left his post. Good job, idiot. Oh, he's probably replacing the plane class. Yep, there it is. Looks like there might be another, might be another path down under here, huh? Yeah. Oh, no, it's just a little hidey hole. Oh, no, there I am. Ah, I see. Okay, this is probably... Hey, idiot, over here. Yeah, come get me. Come get me. Uh-oh. Ah, ah, you got me. <laughs> Fuck. All right, let me out of the corner, idiot. There, fine. A hole. I've broken like five of their pint glasses now. <laughs> I'm sure they got a replacement out there already, right? Yeah, there we go. Boink! <laughs> So what I got? I got to lure him around this way. Hey, come on. 
<laughs> Give him the slip. All right, into the drink it goes. <laughs> ah, that's fun. That's fun. Now we gotta find the toy boat and drop a bucket on the burly man's head. Okay, we can do that. Oh, I think I know how we do that, too. Oh, what platform did I get this on? This is on Steam. PC Steam right now. That's what I'm playing it on. Alright, so here's what we're gonna do. We're gonna untie his shoes, because he's an idiot. <laughs> Bonk. <laughs> okay. So, we gotta plan this out a little bit. We gotta find a bucket, first of all. Find a bucket, which I think there's one over here. Yeah, there's one there. Okay. Um... So, am I gonna be able to grab that, or do I have to knock it onto his head? Ah. Oh, I see. Hmm. Okay. I'm supposed to get him to follow me all the way back there, huh? That's interesting. Oh, I was gonna grab that on my way through. <laughs> Alright, so I have to wait for them to reset that bucket, huh? But now we know where it is. That's the burly man, right? That's considered the burly man? Alright, so we're gonna wait for delivery lady to walk through. We're gonna get the attention of the burly man. Right? Over here. <laughs> Have enough time to get into our hidey hole here. There we go. Oh. To get him to come back here, right? There we go. But then how am I going to get him to... There we go. He's right there. That's fine. Oh no, he's going to try to cut me off the pass. Hey! Over here, idiot! <laughs> There you go. Good boy. Okay. Yeah, yeah, yeah. No, 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 no. No, no, come back. Hey, turn around. Turn around. Go back to the tomatoes. Go back to the tomatoes! Ah, oh, come on. Oh, we need to get him to put the tomato back in the box, and then we dunk the, the bucket on him. There we go. Over here. <laughs> All right. All right. Drop the tomato there. Get the burly man back here. He'll see the tomato and be like, hey, I got to put that back. There you go, buddy. Yeah. Come on. Come on. Okay, they're, they're, they're forming a queue. There you go. Okay. Good job. Now, excuse me. Oh no, he ignored the tomato! Do I have to lay out a trail, maybe? A trail of Reese's Pieces to get him to... 
<laughs> to get him to go over there. He, what's he worried about the pepper grinder for? Not the pepper grinder, go after the tomatoes. The nice bright red and shiny. Ah. Eventually. We'll get him. We'll get him. How many people does it take to find a goose under a table? Apparently more than four. <laughs> They're trying their best. There you go. Oh, oh, he's going for the tomato. Yeah, 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 yeah. Good, good boy. Good boy, good boy. Get into position. <laughs> Here we go. Here we go, buddy. Yeah, do it. Bonk! <laughs> Idiots. <laughs> Sucker! <laughs> <laughs> you got red on your ass. <laughs> All right. Oh, we gotta get the boat yet. Okay. Ah, <laughs> oh, damn. I was hoping he was gonna go for the tomato again. <laughs> Bonk. <laughs> uh. Oh, there's the toy boat. Yeah. Okay. Skip my mind a little bit. Just need to fill up the water, apparently. And then go. Eh? Eh? Oh, we gotta overfill, overfill it. There we go. There you go. <laughs> we did it! We completed the to do list. Uh. I'm gonna go play with my toy boat now. Yeah, worked hard for it. We're gonna enjoy the fruits of our labor. So since we completed the to-do list, there should be a uh, a door that they opened for us now. Somewheres. I think there was a door in the in the back section here. Oop! Yeah, there he is. Okay. Probably just got done opening that door. After putting red on his bum there. Oh no, there's a door here. Oh no, he didn't open that for me though. There. Where 
Or maybe we can just uh, waddle on over to the next section somewhere is here too. steal the harmonica is it's probably one of my favorite altered goose noises is with the harmonica the second favorite is probably the glass bottle oh no I want I want to take this out I want to take this out with me So there was, okay, this canal there. I think there's a way to cross it. Is there a way to cross back? So we open this gate to get out. Mega wish. I think this echoes, right? <laughs> the oh oh I see it went out to the went out to the canal the money now a penny richer or a pence or whatever whatever it is in jolly old UK right oh <laughs> sail the toy boat under a bridge okay uh, I guess we uh, Got a secret Chivo for that. Good job. Good job, good job. Oh, this gate is locked. Shit's locked. Looks like that goes to the factory or something. I want to go to the factory. I want to see the goose in a factory. Oh, we can taunt this dude since we stole his uh, harmonica. <laughs> Can't get to it from this side. Huh? This was the very first area, and this here is where we started. Poked our little goose head out from the uh, from the bushes. We saw this stash of bells over here, right? Alright. Well, we'll stash that for later. That's fine. So now we gotta find uh, a way to get to the next area. The past three areas it's been, well, somebody's like fallen through a door or unlocked a door or something for us, but apparently they are. Expecting more out of us as the goose to find a way through. That's fine. <laughs> That's right. It to be a complete shitlord with no consequences. It is very, very freeing to just be this horrible goose and annoy the heck out of all of these people. To really. To be free to, to say our piece on humanity as a whole and have fun doing it, right? Because humanity sucks. <laughs> I 
Okay. Alright, so we just kind of hassled the pub a little bit, right? Think about your no gooses sign. Here's what I think about it. Oh, uh oh, oh, uh, now I've done it. Uh, eh, eh. <laughs> oh. Except, was there another path around here, too? Oh, no, this is where we... <clears throat> this is where we made, made the neighbors hate each other. Except it looks like she got a new vase, and he probably trimmed a new rose or something, huh? Let's go check in on them. See if they got restraining orders against each other yet or not. Now, looks like he repaired his fence. Very poorly. <laughs> oh man, this is my money. Go get your own. Get your own money, man. This is mine. Hey, ah, oh, it's mine. <laughs> Oh yeah, he did grow a new, a new big rose. Well, here, here's what I'm gonna do. Oh, and she returned all his clothes and shit too. Here, I will offer you a penny, and I will take your go anti-goose propaganda. Seems like a fair trade. I don't know what I'm gonna do with it, but you know, I'll just kind of, eh. And then do that. Need a way back over there. There we go. <laughs> oh, and also for good measure. Uh, I, I want to wait for him to start drinking his tea. Because it's funny. It's more fun that way. Yeah, wait for it. Wait for it. Wait for it. Bong! <laughs> Fucking idiot. <laughs> Bonk! <laughs> Hey, idiot! <laughs> what? I don't know what you're talking about. You broke my face! <laughs> ah, shit. I'm a bad neighbor. <laughs> well, guess what? We're gonna help her get revenge. Here you go. We'll set it up. There you go. Okay. Well, not not the not the fence, but that's fine. She'll, uh, she'll clean up that, that squirrel bush there. There you go. There you go. Alright, I want, I want to be in, in, in sight distance of this. Alright, doing a good job. Ah, shit! <laughs> oh, fuck! I gotta hide the evidence! Uh, uh, and I will take this, because I'm a good goose. <laughs> I 
absconded with my rose. I have earned it. I have earned it. <laughs> uh, amazing. fun. That is fun. Alright. Probably need some water, though. So, uh... Eh. I think this just leads us back to the initial area, right? There we go. There we go. Okay, so... Alright, enough... As much fun as it is to dick around here. Let's, let's see if we can put some serious effort towards getting to the next area. Serious, serious goose time. Oh. I can somehow... Ah, there we go. <laughs> Fuck you, anti-goose propaganda. Oh, wait. Can I swim into this pipe here? I cannot. Boo. Alright, alright. For serious this time. Let's, let's find the next area. I had to. Like, I, I saw that anti-goose sign, I'm like, you know what? No. No, that's, that's, that's too far. We gotta get rid of that. And we did. So now we can look for the next area. <laughs> oh, can we swim upstream there? Okay, uh, this might just take us to the dam now. Do we need to be on this side? There's a little soccer goal thing. How did we miss that? Can we do something about that? Alright. Boot in the water. Pacifier. In the water. Uh, oops. There we go. Glass bottle. <laughs> Coming with us. Alright. Let's see what we can do here. Alright, so there's the package. What should we do with the package? And some mail? I think tampering with mail is a federal offense. But I think that only applies to humans. So as a goose, I believe we are in the clear. So, mail. In the water. <laughs> Package. This will be slightly tougher to get into the water, but we're gonna do it. <clears throat> Teach UPS to deliver late. Yeah. Down the stairs, into the water. <laughs> come on, come on, come on. There we go. Ah, and then this goes to the pub, I think, right? Oh, but there was another another section of the street, maybe? Ah, uh, no. The camera has stymied our progress. <clears throat> yeah, so here's the pub. He still hasn't changed out of his uh, thoroughly reddened pants. Nice job. Guess what? This is what you get for that. There you go. <laughs> Bonk! <laughs> Eat shit. Uh, Alright.
punk. <laughs> okay, let's go to the back of the pub again. Oh, that dude's still missing his harmonica. Sorry, not sorry that I took it from you, buddy. Oh, I see. I'm supposed to climb over the the freshly opened um, thingamabop here. That's clever. All right. Let's open that up. Okay. We did it. Now we're on the opposite side. Oh, we still probably can't open this. Somebody had the presence of mind to put on an anti-goose padlock. Very smart of them. We'll find a way around it, but very smart of them. For now. What do we got going on here? Oh, it's a little tiny model village! In the water. <laughs> There's a little tiny model village. Alright, what can we do here? Steal the beautiful miniature golden bell. Can do. Can do. I can't steal the mailbox though. That's glued down, apparently. Alright, you sir. Can, uh... Go in the water. Well, that's a pretty flower. I think we'll take it. Ah, there's the bell, huh? It's all the way up there. How are we ever to get up there? If only we were some sort of... flighted bird. With apparently a beak of fucking solid steel. <laughs> Or, it's a very shoddily constructed castle. Come on. Yep. It's, it's coming. It's on its way. Oh, we better move. That's gonna come tumbling right down on us. <laughs> Bonk! <laughs> Hell yeah. Take it all the way back home. I see. So here's our... This is where our stash of bells came from, apparently. So we have ransacked this tiny model village like six other times in the past, it seems. And now we are the town crier goose. <laughs> ah, I see. But we can't, uh... Can't take the short way. We gotta go through the pub again, don't we? And they are probably not gonna be happy about me stealing their tiny little model village. Well, huh? Oh, that's right, this tomato. Okay, well we can do this. We can be a we can be a stealthy goose. We can be a stealthy goose. We really just need to make it outside the pub, because then we can jump in the canal and, and go home.
no, I bell. <laughs> Oh, 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 now everybody's, everybody's all excited about the bell. Oh, yeah, perfect, perfect, perfect. <laughs> Don't know what you're talking about, I ain't got nothing. There, we made it out. <laughs> Oh, they put the, the brick back in there, so I can't get down that way. Oh, and they sealed that up, so I can't sneak it out that way. Wow, these are some very foresightful people. They're more protective of their tiny model village than they are of their own property. They lock that gate, too? Oh, clever bastards. All right, so now we really do have to walk it all the way back, huh? They lock that one, too. Man, what'd they put out, an APB on a goose with a bell? Give me a break. Oh. The neighbors opened up their gates? Damn. All right, okay, okay, that's fine. Oh yeah, everybody's on the lookout for this, the goose with the bell. Probably sneak up on the right side there. Just need to go. Okay, I'm gonna need to take apart her very shoddily constructed desk again. No problem. We can do that. No, oh, my bell. <laughs> my bell. All right, did he repair his fence for real? <gasps> he did, what a bitch. All right, that's okay. All right, so he's coming up around there. Oh, he's, he's gonna be a little smarty, huh? Yoink. <laughs> no, my bell. <laughs> You'll never stop the town crier, Goose! Ring, ring, ring! <laughs> Alright. Back to the... Back to the shopkeep here, I guess, huh? That would probably be a good idea to trap the shopkeep, honestly. So let's see. Let's, uh... Drop the bell here, and do some do some hassling. Oh wow, they got both shop keeps out. All right, that one. Hey, I got your carrot. <laughs> you want a carrot? I bet you want a carrot. <laughs> Now that we, since we know that other shopkeeper's out and about, let's take our time. Oh, no. Yeah, there we go. Oh, and then we'll sneak through the empty shop, right? So hopefully she turns. Oh, shit. Yeah, get out of here, nerd. <laughs> What do you think, you're gonna stop a goose with a bell? Yeah? <laughs> Idiot. <laughs> Fucking nerd. All right. Let's see, where's the gardener now? <clears throat> All right. Where is he? Is gardener gonna be the final boss here? Oh yeah, look at this motherfucker, huh? <laughs> All right, shitbag. Here's what we're gonna do. Drop the 
fell here. I'm gonna take his prized rose. Oh, first we're gonna turn that on. Then we're gonna take his rose. Be like, hey, hey, fuck with. Over here. Yeah, you want this rose? I bet you do. Here, go get your rose. see nothing. <laughs> Psych, idiot! Now, unless they put guardrails up over here, I think we're clear. Yeah, there we go. Oh, you made it! That's fun. Okay, so one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. Eight little bells there. And a friendly neighborhood ruined, a friendly neighbor relationship ruined, and a gardener upset, and ruined a dude's pants, and bullied a nerd, and <laughs> we did a lot of stuff as this asshole goose. We'll let the credits roll. This is this is a very fun little diversion. But there's still I think if I was reading correctly, there's like a dozen or so little secret chivos we can get. And we got one accidentally by sailing that boat under the bridge. So maybe we can get a couple more before we call it a night, huh? So we'll see where this, uh, where this ends us up here. Oh, we got a new to-do list. Oh, here we go. Nice. Ah, okay. <laughs> all right. So this this is probably all the. Okay. Yep. This is all the secret trivos. Awesome. Awesome. All right. Perform at the pub wearing a ribbon. Okay. <laughs> Steal the old man's woolen hat. Okay. I think we we know how to do probably most of this stuff. All right. Let's go. Lock the groundskeeper out of the garden. Easy. One, we just need to make sure he can't get back in. <clears throat> so we need his keys. So, uh, all right. You just want to go do your thing. I'm just going to... Blink those keys, or maybe not, all right, it's fine. Just gonna yoink those keys, you don't need these. Guess where they're going? Into the water. <laughs> you ain't getting these keys back, sucker. Yeah, you gonna come in after me? Huh? Huh? Oh yes, oh shit! <laughs> oh no. How to put them where you can't get them. <laughs> all right. Fucking groundskeeper. All right. Well, while he's out here searching for his keys, then. <laughs> 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 Fucking loser. <laughs> and then we can just go. <laughs> there. Try to get back in, idiot. You can't, cause you don't got your keys. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, what are you gonna do? 
You could jump that waist high fence? Yeah, I'd like to see you try. Come on. Do it. He ain't gonna. Which means I can totally wreck the shit out of his garden <laughs> while he's gone. Fucking idiot. Alright, so what was it? Collect the five flowers in the basket over by the well. Oh, I see. We gotta put the flowers in the basket. I see, I see, I see. Okay. A tulip, a, liz a lily, a rose, a daisy, and a chrysanthemum. Well, I don't know what one of those looks like, so... We're gonna have to do our best. This looks like, perhaps, a tulip, right? Hmm. Maybe we should have snuck that out of the garden before we locked that bitch ass out, huh? Ah, well. So wait, is there anything... Oh, a cabbage picnic! Ah, oh, we can't do that, though, because we locked the, the, the door. Oops. Where are the cabbages? Oh, yeah, there are the cabbages. Jeez, those are some big cabbages. Oh, there we go. Oh, you made it back in. Well, shit. Well, it's my flower, though. <laughs> Still my flower. Fuck you. <laughs> yeah, what, are you gonna chase me? You gonna chase me all the way, huh? to be uninterested in its flower. <laughs> eh. Hey, it's my flower. I stole it fair and square. Idiot. No. There we go. Eh. There we go. <laughs> No, I fought too hard for this. Drop that flower. It's mine. Mine. A hole. <laughs> there we go. <laughs> yeah, come get it. Come get it, idiot. <laughs> oh no, he's coming to get it. How dare he? Alright, he lost interest. Yeah, go fix your cabbages. I don't know who messed those up. Alright, there's one flower. There's the tulip. Oh, wow. Oh, I see. Okay, so they're the... Okay, you can speed run each of the four areas then, too, if you really want to. I probably won't do that, but that's fun regardless. Uh, Alright, catch an object as it's thrown over the fence. Okay, we can do that. Get thrown over the fence. Hmm, interesting. Dress up the bust with things from outside the back garden. Score a goal. Alright, that makes sense. That's the, the purpose of that soccer goal we saw before. Form at the pub wearing a ribbon, we know where that is. We know how to do that. Steal the old man's woolen hat, I'm pretty sure we know how to do that. Oh, we can probably use that to, to dress up the bust, too. Trip the boy in the puddle, make the shop scales go ding, open an umbrella inside the TV shop. Make someone from outside the high street buy back their own stuff. Collect the five flowers, okay, we just did part of that. Alright, uh, trip the boy in the puddle. We can do that. He's easily scared. 
grab a ribbon first. Let's get dressed up in the ribbon. Let's let's go put on some finery, and then go scare the nerd. Wait, what the heck is that thing? Oh, the anti-goose propaganda we left. Very good. Uh, he still didn't repair his thing. Idiot. do her thing. <clears throat> oh, God, how fucking hard this thing was to move. <clears throat> Done putting your fake ass goose back up there, all right? I'm gonna steal it again. Ah, man, their priorities. <laughs> yeah, yeah. Go, go. Focus on the bell. That's a good idea. Good idea. Good idea on that one, honey. So then we can push that one off to the side there. And you can wonder where that is, and then you can go get a go get a ribbon. You know, I would have preferred the blue one, but you know the red's fine too. Fancy ribbon, we can get out of here. Oh, we could have done the. Yeah, okay. Um, uh, the back door's not gonna be open though, is it? Alright. I've changed my mind. There's one other thing we can do very quickly while we're around here. <clears throat> we need to. Get something that this idiot is going to toss over the fence. <clears throat> like this. Oh, oh, she wants it. She wants it back. Alright. This in his uh, his visual range there, and then we need to get over there to catch it. And hope that he hurries up and hobbles over here so we can catch it. Come on, buddy. There you go. Hurry. <laughs> Got it. <laughs> <laughs> I'm kind of surprised. Surprised that we uh, still got that Achievo for it, because it very clearly broke. <laughs> but apparently, we caught it just in time. Alright. Oh, we can get thrown over the fence, too, somehow. I don't know how, but we'll try it. We'll try it. Uh, okay. Well... We should probably go perform at the pub first, since we, we got all dressed up fancy-like.
Uh, excuse me. One goose for uh, concert performance, please. Please let me through. Bonk. <laughs> Ah, <laughs> uh, that's fun. All right, I need to get that dude's uh, that dude's hat now. So we need him to. Um, I think we need him to fall over so we can steal it off his head. Ding dong. Stand. Or don't. Whatever. There you go. Okay. Yeah, don't worry. <laughs> there we go. <laughs> Yoink. <laughs> <laughs> also, I want to sneak this out so we can uh, go do one more thing with it. There we go. Grand Theft Hat succeeded. Uh, Alright, I need to go back this way. I'll give you the hat, and for my troubles, I will take a coin. Aha, but we need to fully dress it up with different things. Okay. Alright, well, um, we know where we can get a pair of glasses. What else could it conceivably wear? Because before... When we were doing this area the first time, it was the dude's pipe here. But we don't want to do that again. I specifically want stuff from outside this area. Uh, hmm. Alright, we'll have a think about that. We know where we can get one more. And we need to somehow get thrown over the fence. Hmm. Lost our ribbon. Right. Hmm. How could we get this dude to huck us over the fence? Maybe we'll have a think about that one and come back. But for now, we can go trap the boy in the garage. <laughs> no, well, we can knock him into the puddle. Easy peasy. <clears throat> so let's go back to the shop then. Quite a few things we probably know how to do there.
Okay, so... <coughs> oh, excuse me. Alright, uh, so we need to mess with the scale? Can we do that? How are you supposed to... There. Ah! There we go! <laughs> I'm not sure how we did that, but, uh, and we did it. Okay, good, good. Uh, trip the boy in the puddle. Can do. We'll also need his soccer ball. Alright, buddy, guess where you're going. Oh, we can, uh, oh, we gotta undo his shoelaces! Yeah. Yeah, 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 you get over there. Get over there, idiot. Did that count? Yeah! <laughs> you fucking nerd. Alright. Yeah. This way, ding dong. This way. Your shoes are still untied there, by the way. <laughs> okay, good. Huh? No, no. This way. Keep going. Getting warmer. Getting warmer. Over here. There you go, good boy. Huh? Yeah, you're almost there. You're almost there, trust me. Goose would never lay you astray. Okay. Bonk! <laughs> At least he got his glasses back. If I was really mean, I would have taken them out with me. <laughs> All right, so oh, I need a I need the umbrella. I need an umbrella. Um Take this one. And also, I will need this later as well. Okay, yeah, yeah, get your dumb broomstick out of here. Mine now. Okay. I need to kind of huck this right here, right? And then... Hey, guess what, Dingleberry? Guess where you're going? You're going into the phone booth. <laughs> Yeah, get get your butt in there. Get your butt in there and call for help. Yeah, go on. <laughs> oh, 
Okay. And then wait for it. Uh, what do we need to do this with? We just needed to open it in the TV shop, right? <clears throat> yeah. Just hide just around the corner. And then... Open it up. Oh, <laughs> <laughs> it's just a big ass fucking umbrella. <laughs> ah, yeah, you were a party to that one. How do you feel about that one, nerd? <laughs> ah, that's good shit. That's good shit. Okay, alright. Um. Like someone from outside the high street buy back their own stuff. Okay, so we need to bring something saleable into the shop and get him to buy it back. Hmm, how though? How though? We'll have to take a look around and see what we can see. Shop is now property of the Umbrella Corporation. <laughs> yeah, a little bit, huh? I really wanted to get the multicolored one in there, but <clears throat> the shopkeeper was being a little... a little cranky, so we had to grab what we could grab. Score a goal. Okay, we need to find the... Um, we need to find where the uh, soccer goal was, because we got the ball. It might have just been down here somewhere, is right? Jeez, yeah, it's going to be as... As good as rolling a spherical object <clears throat> at, at long distance physics can be, huh? Uh, where did we see that goal? It was around here somewhere, huh? No. All right, let's do some scouting. We know where the soccer ball is. Let's uh, scout out where that goal is. Like, I thought it was nearby... When did we see it? We saw it when we were floating down the canal, I think, right? I think. Must have been <clears throat> must have been in the next area. Okay, then we'll we'll take this with us. Or try to. Good lord. Yeah, good, good. Yeah, that's that's what we wanted. No, oh, dude. out of there. No, why the hell is it? No! Jesus, for God's sake. Man, Goose is bad at soccer fundamentals here. Sir, get out of the way. Oh, yeah, you know what you're gonna get just for that, buddy? You know what's gonna happen to you? Yeah. Yeah, no, no, go ahead. Replace that sign, I dare you. Surely nothing will- nothing bad will happen to- to one of the digits on your hand. <laughs> Fucking idiot. <laughs> Alright, good. Go get your sign. We try to get it through this wide ass door here. There we go.
but how do you manage to do that? Okay. <clears throat> I'll leave it out here by the well and go look for the goal. Uh, that goes back to the back gardens. We have to get it across this narrow bridge. Actually, wait. I hope we don't, because that's going to be a pain in the ass. Ah, there it is. Okay. <clears throat> so wait, they want me to fucking... Ah, oh, they want me to roll it through the back gardens over here. Oh, that's kind of silly. Alright, well, okay. We can do that. It's gonna be a bitch and a half, but we can do it. We're gonna have somehow have to, um... Well, actually, maybe we can use that dude to our, our advantage here. So we left it by the well, yeah? but sure. somehow get it around this corner. Taking corners is bad. Straightaways are relatively okay. There. See, I say that. I can't fucking get it to go forward. controls meets ball physics. Okay, now we gotta get it to somehow get in that narrow ass gap. Okay, there you go. Nice and easy. get this dude to huck it over the fence for us. No, how do you... What kind of angle was that? Come on. Physics. There you go, buddy. Yeah, get that ball. Huck it over the fence. Yeah, there you go. Yeah, all right. <laughs> okay. That's serviceable. Thank you.
One more narrow gap. Yeah. Yeah. Hey. Yeah. Oh, probably gotta give it a little boost. A little boost to get out of there. There we go. Seems to be a fucking incline down. Come on. Get out of the caught in every goddamn corner. Oh my god, come on. There. Okay. Need to get it out onto open field. Slope your lawn like this, you're a bad person. I don't make the rules. Get out of that fucking corner! There. Alright, open field. No goalie. Oh, for God. <laughs> oh, geese are not good at soccer, are they? How. Okay. Oh my god, it's as bad as real soccer. Get in the fucking goal. No! No, don't go over in this corner. Fucking... something to give you on the greens and golf games like give me a slope meter or something so I can tell where the fuck this thing is sloping to all one flat ass shade of green to me okay there you go it's an easy hey score <laughs> all right fine we did that one that was annoying uh, all right uh, get thrown over the fence we don't know what to do with for that. Um, dress up the bus with things outside the back gardens. We got one of presumably three. Uh, cabbage picnic would be a, probably a pain in the butt. Someone from outside the high street buy back their own stuff. What does anybody else have that they would want to buy back? I don't know. But I know where to get a rose. Right? Can we still... Oh, what did we do with that rose? Shit. We popped it in the water, right? Oh, it's probably down by the pond. Actually, that's good. That's good. That's good. Um, so what else do we need? A lily. A daisy and a chrysanthemum. Hmm. I'll think about... Uh... Let's see what she's painting there. I don't like it. <laughs> What was it? A, a lily, a rose, a daisy, and a chrysanthemum. Well, probably one per each major area, right? Are these pick upable here? No? Alright, we already fucked with the mail. That was fun. What does a chrysanthemum look like? I don't know if I would recognize those on sight. But let's see. Alright, so here we are at the pub. There should be a flower of some sort around here, right? If it goes by the areas, then there's probably a daisy in here somewhere. Alright, guess what, buddy? I'm gonna have to come in the pub, so uh, you could kindly retie your shoes. Or 
trip over yourself, one of the two. Oh my god, he's doing an incredible job boxing out there. There we go. <laughs> oh, there! Yeah, we can get the flower from performing. Hopefully, uh, he won't interrupt my Opus Magnum here. Okay, yeah, here he comes. Everybody's a critic. So if we find the rose floating by, uh, floating down here, then that'll be three out of the five, right? So I think we definitely dropped it in the well. Presumably it still persists in this world somewhere, right? Yep, there it is. Wow, we put a lot of stuff in the water. <laughs> Amazing. Okay, good. Well, that's that's good then. Now we can just pop up to the well, drop this in the basket, and we'll be 60% of the way there after we go back and grab the rose. Yep, there we go. Daisy. Oh, wait. Oh, I bet we can get the chrysanthemum from the model village. That was the thing, right? That was the, the final area, the fifth area. There's the rose. Okay, let's go check the model village again. Did they replace the bell? Can I steal the bell again? That would be fun. Alright, so sir, I'm gonna need to get in the pub again. I know you just want to do your job and be a bouncer, but I gotta get in, so see ya. Da 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 bonk! <laughs> Fucking idiot. Oh, okay, the gate's already open. That's right. Oh, that gate's open too. Oh, I could have gone right through. Ah, well. Uh, alright. I just gotta find me a little chrysanthemum, huh? Oh, right. We had grabbed another flower from somewhere. Oh, I bet it was the one we plucked before, yeah? Yeah, we put it down on the hedge here. <laughs> Yoink! See? We were thinking ahead, without even knowing we were thinking ahead. So then we just need to make our way back to the second area and grab... What was it? A lily. See, we may be an asshole goose, but we are a cultured asshole goose. We seek to beautify as well as destroy. Okay, well, it would stay in the basket, please. Oh boy. There we go. Close enough? Close enough. Okay, and we can also probably get that dude to open his, uh, his garden door again, because we're going to need to get those cabbages out to the picnic. Eventually. <laughs> hmm. 
<clears throat> so. Boink. Eventually he'll want to turn that off, right? Where is he? We need him to open that door. Oh, there he is. Oh, he went all the way around because he doesn't have his keys. All right, I should give him back his keys. That was fun while I lasted. Good thing I left them in a well-known spot. Or can I use the keys to open the door? That would be kind of fun. Let's see. Do we, as a goose, know how to open a door? No, we do not. We, in fact, do not. Alright, so we'll just do this again. Get him to come out here. Clo turn, turn on the water. Turn off the water, rather. And then he'll see his keys and be like, oh, that's where I dropped them. I'll be like, yep, that's, that's definitely true. That's definitely where you dropped them. And you know what? I'm gonna want some music at my cabbage picnic, so, uh, could we... Grab the radio. There we go. He is gonna come back out here and turn that off, yeah? Taking a sweet time. <clears throat> Go check on him. Be like, hey, buddy. You, uh... Or maybe he's still walking back from the first time. <laughs> That'd be kind of funny. Oh, there he is. Come on. Pump those legs. I want to see two more laps out of you. Two more laps. See your keys? Yeah, good boy. You gonna open the door? He's gonna restack that. He's gonna wonder where the radio is. Oh no, he's gonna know where it is because it's making noise. Ah. All right, fine. Let's let's hurry this along. There you go, buddy. I do need need you to open your door though, because I want those cabbages. Please. Thank you. Maybe now we're gonna have to roll these suckers along, huh? Uh, at least the soccer ball we could explicitly hit. These we just kind of gotta... Yeah. 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 Oh, yeah, uh, it kind of rolls on its own. That's nice. And a little bit more ball control on this one. Oh, no, not in the water though. Ah, uh, nobody likes wet cabbage. Do they? I don't even like dry cabbage. Oh, God's sake. Onto the dry ground. Yeah. Oh my god. Oh no, why is it sloped towards the water? <laughs> ah. No, don't fucking. Oh my god. You know what? No, that's a good staging area, actually. Because it's probably too far out of this dude's vision radius for him to care. So we'll just kind of roll them all out, and then we'll, uh, and then we'll fiddle with the. Uh... Excuse me, sir. No, no, no. What? Yeah, this is gonna be fun.
Hey, how about you worry about your carrots, huh? Yeah, here. Worry about your carrots. And your sign that I'm pulling down, okay? Yeah, you do that. <coughs> While I steal another cabbage. Very slowly steal another cabbage. You know, it is pretty amazing that everybody that we've met has an anti-goose sign of some sort ready to go. It's like they knew there was going to be an asshole goose, eventually, running around. Okay, two, two cabbages staged. Yeah, I don't know what happened to that cabbage, buddy. But here, I'm going to steal another carrot. And turn on your water. And, uh, knock over your jam jar. And pull up your sign. There. Fix all that shit while I steal a third cabbage. Also your rose. So these two are gonna be the, the big bitches to get out, so they're the farthest away. Alright, gonna pick your carrots? Pick your carrots. No, there's so much other shit for you to fix! Don't worry about the cabbage! Fine. You know what? Let's take your keys, idiot. Here. Over here. Here. Maybe focus on all the shit I wrecked over on this side of the garden. And don't worry none about your cabbages. Why are you even growing cabbages? Cabbages suck. Now where'd I leave it? There it is. actually get this one properly onto the picnic basket, picnic blanket. No? Well, all right, it'll hang out there for a second. <clears throat> all right, yeah, go plant your rose. Did he already put it back as sign? Man, he's quick. He's a quick boy. Fortunately for him, I'm a quick goose. Guess what? I'm gonna swipe your keys. Giving him keys. Also, what do you... All right, gonna do a little dance. Have a little fun? Get down tonight? What the hell is he doing? <laughs> no, give him keys. <laughs> oh, he did put up his sign already. Wow. Here, I'm gonna put your keys down over here. I'm gonna go fuck up your sign. Yeah. You know what? Just for being a gigantic pain in my goose butt, guess what's gonna happen to you now? Try to pound in that sign. I dare you. <laughs> Idiot. suppose if I wanted to be really thorough, I'd swipe his keys and close the gate. No, what the hell? Hey, no. That cabbage is my property now. Yeah. As are these keys. Jesus. On point with his cabbage rescue there. Here, put up your sign again. I don't know who keeps taking it down, but you better put it back up. Alright, let's get this last cabbage out of his way. Alright, now I gotta get all four of them to the picnic blankets. Oh, no. Oh, my god, this is gonna be a nightmare.
Okay, I can't even I can't even hit it like I did the soccer ball. So, all right. No, like what kind of physics is that? Oh, you only need one of them. Oh god damn it. Ah. <laughs> uh, uh, <laughs> all right, whatever. It's fine. Oh, he fucking stole his tulip back, too. Oh, what a piece of shit. Ah. All right, well, we need that tulip back, so uh, we're going to go hassle this guy one more time. It's like, wow, he got a flower. All right, this is mine. Little shit bag. Can't stop my flower arranging goofs here. Fuck it. Like, what? <sighs> one cabbage. We only needed one. Oh man, I'm so annoyed. <laughs> I'm so annoyed. We did so much work. And we didn't need to do nearly that much work. Ah, well. Okay, so now we need to go find a lily from the shop area, I think. Oh, I wonder if we could get, um... Hmm, you know, I wonder. Maybe we could get him to buy his, uh... Buy one of his things. Um, maybe his trowel? Hey. You want this? Yeah, I bet you do. Oh, that's a long walk to the shop. Shit, I should have thought about this. Eh, 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 eh. Uh, he's got slightly faster than I am. Ah, oh, you piece of shit. Ah! Guess what? Yeah, you want you want your keys? Hey. Yeah, I got something more valuable. Hey, I dare you to uh buy your keys back. <clears throat> nah, he didn't buy his keys back. Maybe By his trowel? Oh yeah! Hey, there's some garden tools over there. I can probably put it in the garden tools. Or she can put it in the garden tools. Or you can try to catch me. Dumb idiot. There. Garden tools. I just need to steal his keys. Where did he go? I need to get him back to the shop. Wow, he booked it on out. He's like, no, fuck this. I gotta get back to my garden. I'm like, no man. Hey, guess what you gotta do? Oh, grab the keys. Grab the keys. Get your fucking... Got your keys! <laughs> Coming through! I don't know if this is going to work. I don't know if he's going to buy his trawl. Yeah, there you go. Buy your trawl, buddy. Buy it. Do it. Ha <laughs> ha fucking loser, pay up. Pay up, idiot! <laughs> Alright, just for that, here. Get your keys back. Ha ha ha! Fucking idiot. Alright, cool. That works. Um, a lily. We need a lily. Where can we get a lily? In this area, probably. Are there any flowers for sale? Oh yeah, there it is. Guess what? Yoink! <laughs> Easy peasy. The goose with the greenest thumb. Or greenest beak, I suppose. Uh... 
I'm gonna laugh at him one more time because he's such an idiot. <laughs> Fucking loser. <laughs> there we go. It's so beautiful. It's so beautiful. Alright, what else? Oh, we did the entirety of that one. Nice. Get thrown over the fence and dress up the bus with things from outside the back garden. So, okay. Okay. Uh, well... We got the old dude's hat from the pub. Oh, we could get the kid's glasses. Yeah. Let's get the kid's glasses. Those big-ass Coke bottles. Big-ass Coke bottle bottom glasses. Let's go. Let's go hassle the nerd one more time. Hey, remember me? Yeah, you remember me, don't you? I need him to trip so he can... There we go. Bonk. And then... Oh no, I need his glasses! Lady, get the fuck out of the way! Here, yeah. You like... You fucking broken ass broom? Here, come get it. Alright, you need to get out of the shop, kid. There we go. I need to get around and... Boink! <laughs> ah, ah, ah. Alright, we're gonna go this way, then. Oh, for extra laughs. I can get the dude to throw these over the fence. For us. I wonder if they'll break. I guess we'll find out. We'll find out. Um, hmm. And then I think we're missing, like, one more piece of clothing, right? Because it, it was the dude's hat, the dude's pipe, and... Um... What else was it? And the dude's glasses, yeah. But now we've got the old man's hat, the kid's glasses... And then we need one other thing. One other stealable article of clothing. There you go. Put those on. I'm sure that uh, that statue's prescription. There we go. Yeah, it looks really good. Nice job. <laughs> okay, uh... Like, there's, is there maybe a scarf or something we can swipe somewhere? Bust up this house a little bit more. <laughs> okay, what else could we dress that sucker up with? Got some headwear. Got some glasses. Uh. Alright, let's look around the pub again. Sir? Excuse me. Bonk! <laughs> Alright, let's see. What else? What else can we swipe here? Also, I would like that dart, please. No? Anything we can swipe around here that would be a wearable thing. Mm. Mm, uh, maybe not. What about the model village? 
Maybe the model village has something. What did we drop over here? Oh, the tomato. Guess where that's going? In the water. Let's see. Let's see. What would be a wearable item again? Over here. Anything? Perhaps not something, huh? Because, let's see, we got a hat from the pub, right? And we got the glasses from the market, so maybe from the, the first garden area? If we're following the whole, oh, one thing from each other area thing, you know? Wow, we fucking tore this shit apart. <laughs> I love it. Kinda love it. Uh... Hmm. Oh, wow. There's even a tinier model village in the tiny model village. Damn. Pretty philosophical, honestly. Okay, I don't think there's a, an article of clothing in the model village that'll help us, huh? Got those things glued down. Well, as long as we're hucking shit in the water. Into the water. And you. And you. Because my thought is maybe the original... Maybe we can swipe something off the original gardener dude. Because we made him wear his sun hat before, right? But... Well... I don't know if another hat is the ticket. I guess we can try it. Whilst we're looking around, right? A boot? Does a boot work? Oh! Maybe a pacifier. Would that work? I mean, that'd be pretty weird. But, you know, we can give it a try. And we can hassle the gardener afterwards if this doesn't work. Uh, around this area, right? Because this is like a, a mouth-based thing, right? And we needed a mouth-based article of clothing. Because we, we had the hat, we had the glasses, and then we needed something to put in its mouth, right? We did the pipe last time. me, just tromping right back in here. And if this works, let's see. Yeah, slam it on in there. Why not? Yeah! That was our uh, celebratory honk. <laughs> <laughs> All right, cool. Now we just got to get thrown over the fence. How the hell are we going to get thrown over the fence? Got to have something to... Got to have something to do with this dude, right? Because he's always hucking shit over the fence. But how would we get him to, to hurl us? Maybe if we bribe him. Hmm. 
Hmm. What would be... What would cause him to throw us over, do you think? What would be... What could we do to annoy him so bad that he would huck a poor, harmless, innocent goose over the fence? While we're thinking about it, let's uh, <laughs> let's swipe his shoes again. <laughs> hey, Tormod, how you doing? Good to see you. Uh, bad goose, bad goose time is really fun. It's a funny, awesome experience. Liberate his shoes one more time. Oh, all right. <laughs> Maybe give him a wash. Maybe it's the lady that hucks us over the fence. That would be a, a, a clever turn of things, wouldn't it? Does she ever huck something back? If, if I could annoy her enough to, uh... Hmm. What does it say? Get thrown over the fence. a little bit more. <laughs> Let's well, shove that in the corner so we can be like, ah, where'd it go? Ah. Alright. Yeah. Scratch your head about it. <laughs> and then give me a little pretty bow. <laughs> Eventually she's going to get fed up and huck me over the fence, right? Thank you. 
So I can get him all mad by ringing the bell. But I can't... Well, I can't get him mad by, uh... By trimming his rose anymore, because we hucked that thing already. Let's have a think about this. So far, the only person that has thrown stuff over the fence has been this dude, right? Her vase, her clothes, the penny we dropped on his area, right? He doesn't like shit being all messy over on his half of the yard here. Also, this is now my pipe. <laughs> also, smoking is bad for your health. Oh, I've got an idea. I've got an idea. Okay. I think that if I... If I grab a hold of something as he is uh, hucking it over, maybe, maybe I go along for the ride. Boy, that's gonna be interesting. All right, buddy. Here, you wanna you wanna break this vase again? Go for it. I dare you. It's gonna gonna be a little bit of timing, I think. Nope. No. Ah! <laughs> Fucking loser. <laughs> uh. <laughs> Alright. So, good thought. But mayhaps not the way to do it. Hmm. Oh, okay. I've got another idea. Same, same general idea, but with something different. Excuse me. Nope. Fine. <laughs> Here. Maybe I can grab one end of it, and he grabs the other. Oh, yeah, yeah. Oh, no. no I don't want to grab the end that he's got. I want to grab the other end. No, no, no. Hey. Oh no. Yeah, yeah, come on. <sighs> Figured it'd be like a little sling or something. Oh. Hmm. 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 Yeah, you know, you really like wearing a, a wet hat on your head, ain't you? <laughs> Idiot. <laughs> Idiot. <laughs> okay, uh, hmm, what else could we do? What else could we do to get thrown over the fence? I 
trying to think of all the things he could throw over that maybe... Oh! Oh, I've got an idea! I've got an idea. Oh, okay. Alright, this is gonna take a little bit of walking. But I'll explain on the way! So there's this box. There's this box over in the pub, right? That, uh... Let's make a mess in this house first. There's this box over the pub, right, that we used to sneak in the first time? We might be able to drag it back here, get in the box, and then have him huck the box over the, the fence with us in it. That would be fun. So, I just need to uh, take this box. Oh my god, this is going to take a while. Take this box back to uh, that area and see what we can do with it. Oops, not this way. Uh, this way. Probably need it open side up so I can actually get in it. So, uh, how do we get back there now? Uh, we might need to go for a swim. There we go. Beep! 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 <laughs> Alright, so the box is going to be a little moist, but I don't think we can avoid that. this works, this is going to actually be pretty funny. Pretty funny and clever if it does work. It's clearly he's not going to throw me over the fence if he knows, like, I'm, I'm a goose, right? He wanted nothing to do with an actual live goose. But, maybe if he doesn't know it's a goose, everything will be fine. We're also probably going to have to do this quickly while he's not looking, because otherwise he might get a little suspicious. Alright, so, we'll let him have a... We'll let him have a sip of his tea. We'll wait for him to get back to reading his pape. Get his news. Headline, asshole goose on the loose. There you go. There you go. Yeah. Yeah, there you go. Ah, oh, he's, he's doing it. Yeah! Love it. All right, was there anything else aside from the speedrun things that we can do then? No, nope, I think that's the entire list. I mean, aside from the speedrunning each area, which, eh. And obviously the, the very final one. Okay, well, I think maybe we call that good. We call that good. Um... Yeah, we've had our fun as an asshole goose. Nice and short and sweet and excellent art design, good sound design, funny as heck. Oh. <laughs> <laughs> Alright. I think we'll call it there for tonight, though. <laughs> Oh, well, very good. This was a nice little short little one week thing. Excellent job, House House, and everybody else who was involved. We had a good time being a really mean goose. So good job, everybody.
Well, that'll do it for tonight. Um, next stream will be tomorrow night, 7.30 p.m. CST. Uh, Shmup Book Club. So it'll be either Parsec 47 or Guy Rez or Dodan Pachi Daifukatsu. <clears throat> um, and then Saturday, question mark PM CST. will be Saturday Grab Bag. We'll pick out something fun and cool and maybe something we played before. Who knows? It's Grab Bag. Um, and then Sunday, 7 p.m. CST. will be Sunday Long Play. Uh, we might just do Noida again. Because <laughs> we've been having a good time with that as well. Uh, that'll do it for tonight. Thanks for watching, everybody. I'll see you tomorrow. Bye-bye.